Good morning. How y'all doing today? It's time for another video. Welcome back to the channel. This is EUC NYC guy cruising and bruising up on 3rd Avenue in Manhattan headed north towards the Bronx. I am on the veteran chairman and I am microphoned up with Little Dead Cat and Insta360 with histogram GPS on screen data turned on along with uh, what am I missing here? One more thing. Anyway, let's do this thing. It's a little cold today. My hands are cold. I was not expecting that. The weather's been getting warmer and warmer, and now it's just cold again. I'm not sure what's going on there. But we're always ready. We're always bold and resilient. We're always going to get it done. No matter what the cost. Well, hopefully. Anyway, I hope you're doing well. Please leave a comment below. If you have a suggestion, idea, retort, or even just a general limerick. Limerick? Yeah, if you have a limerick, put it in the comments. I'm not even sure what a limerick is, to be honest. Uh, an anecdote? Um, an alliteration? An onomatopoeia? Anything prose, verbose, written, or otherwise that can be ascribed, feel free to drop it in that comment box below. Just keep it all age appropriate. This is a family friendly channel. Folks, this is Sparta. No, 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 it's not Sparta, it's just New York City. Ah, uh, huh, okay. Question. Question about lactose intolerance, people out there. If you're lactose, if you're lactose intolerant or allergic to dairy or milk, how do you get by? What kind of good, fun, delicious, healthy snacks do you eat? Because I feel like there's nothing good. Everything's got milk in it, even salt and vinegar potato chips, which seems like it's the last thing that would have milk in it. But go figure. Uh, yeah, even the things you don't expect to have milk in them have milk in them, so what do you do? I like mixed seeds and uh, peanut butter granola bars, but like, you can only eat so many of those before you're just like, huh, that uh, Oreo cookie looks good. Even though that's junk, even if you just don't count junk, even though junk, most of it is the milk. But if you don't count junk food, what delicious non-dairy and I guess while you're doing non-dairy, you might as well throw the non-gluten in there as well. But what delicious snacks, or even foods overall, can you have? That's really good. Um, coffee, oat milk, decaf. I'm not a caffeine guy, but decaf oat milk coffee. Okay, a little acidic, not too great for the stomach, especially on those tougher days where you really can't take much more acid. But what else? And yes, I consider that a snack. A decaf coffee with oat milk is a delicious snack. Uh, what else? Hmm, let me think. I like, oh, oatmeal cranberry or oatmeal raisin cookies are delicious. Soft and gooey, yep. Count me in for some of that. Chocolate chip cookies, nope. That's gassy. I mean, lactose <laughs> Or if that's one and the same to you, yes. Um, hmm. Let's me think. Whoa. Okay. All right. Yeah, she, I mean, she didn't see me, but. Drive defensively, people. What do I tell you? What do I always say in those situations? It's my own fault. It's my own fault for existing. Just kidding. <laughs> Not for existing, but it's my own fault. I got to take care of my own health and well-being. I got to watch out. I got to expect the unexpected. That isn't to say that it would be my fault if something were to happen. But, uh, yeah, so you got to do that little waving, even if you can't see them. And she did a little stutter step swerve away when she saw my hand, which is great. Because it means she saw me and we didn't collide. Thank you. 
That guy's cleaning up the bridge. That's nice. I always wondered why the bridge was always so spotless. Well, he's kind of, he's picking the weeds off the edge. I don't know if he was picking up litter necessarily, but I still see a lot of litter. But I'm sure there's another person or him that do pick up the litter ultimately as well. Uh-huh. So what else is going on today? There were a few topics. I've been trying to make a list now. Now that we have the vocal situation worked out, it seems like uh, now we just need the intriguing, riveting ideas and subjects. And uh, I have something to say about just about everything and anything. If you leave an idea or a topic suggestion in the comments, I'll definitely add it to the list. And guess what? If it's a great idea, I'm going to have to push it on all the way upwards to the top of the list. Because here at NYC Guy, we eat dessert first. That's right. We go straight for the goods. And we'll have the uh, terrible, healthy, main course, delicious dinner meal afterwards. After we get through the dessert. So there. Huh. Ooh. Got in time just for the light to be open or closed, however you want to look at it. I do have to go a little bit on the yellow tram line here in the middle and just hope for the best. I see that some of these cars want to go through and there's a holding up traffic. So if you got to make your turn, make your turn quick so that you're not holding up the tram line behind you. I mean the traffic line. Guys, I hope you're doing healthy and well. This is, we are approaching the end of our ride. Yep, going into oncoming traffic for safety. You remember this spot? Yep. It's the thumbnail for that one video. And uh, I had to do it aggressively and suddenly that one day to avoid a car just, I don't know, side swiping me. But uh, not this time. This time I was just doing it to give myself some space for safety and to be able to get through without obstruction. And the light has changed. Therefore, I shall slow down, come to a stop, and give the cars and people the right of way. And there I have done so, and now I'm proceeding safely with caution. And here we are at our stopping point. Folks, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Hit the like, subscribe, share, comment button if you dare. And I'll see all of you on the next one. Goodbye.